everyone, welcome to the video. Thank you so much for being here. Today I am doing some shopping at Ikea. Ikea is most definitely one of my favorite stores to shop at for home related items. And I hadn't been in quite a few months and there was a few things I was looking to grab. So I was pretty excited to go have a look around here. So this is just gonna be a shop with me style video sharing some new or interesting finds at Ikea as well as a mini haul at the end. They were actually redoing a lot of the like built-in display models here. So there was a lot of like interior construction going on when I was here. This bed with these lace curtains was a display I had never seen before, but I thought it was really pretty and romantic looking. I also thought this gold mirror was gorgeous, even though I thought $50 was a little steep for it. They had a lot of new like crocheted, bohemian, natural kind of looking new storage options. And I also thought the hanging knobs across the wall was a really good use of space. And I needed to grab a few more throw pillow inserts for my screened in porch sofa. I was like losing it about these little faces on these magazine holders. I don't know if these were intended to be faces because I don't know what the two holes are for. Even though I knew I wasn't getting any big ticket items, I did stop and look at some of the sofas. They've got some really good options that are pretty budget friendly. As you guys probably know, I definitely like a more traditional style over like the minimalist modern. And they've got some really good choices. This green sofa I thought was really pretty, but the color looks completely off to what it was in the store. I also really liked the red floral one and this velvet one I had never seen before. I think it's new, so luxurious. If you do like a fancy glam style in your house, I think this would look gorgeous. I also found this pillow here and I really wanted to take it home with me. I thought it was so pretty, but I could not justify $25 on a throw pillow, so it didn't happen. Here are the Alex drawer systems that I have in my home office. I do get quite a lot of questions about my desk setup at home. And this is exactly what I use for my setup. These drawers are great for craft organizing and I needed to grab a few more of these organizational trays for my drawers. I also get a good amount of questions about the little trash bin attached to the door in my bathroom closet. And there it is, it's from here. I think they're only like $3. And the other narrow one is a plastic bag holder, which I have in another one of my closets. Those are two good cheap pieces I always recommend to people. I thought this black dining room table was really pretty. I had never seen it before. I love the classic legs. came across this new bedding, which I had never seen before, and I thought it was so pretty. I love the vibrant colors of this floral design. So it comes in a set of a duvet cover with pillowcases. I 
also thought this cherry blossom peach colored one was really pretty. And then this is one that has been around for years, but I think it is just classic. It is beautiful. I love that black and white toile design. They also have a good variety of like knobs and handles at Ikea I never really thought twice about. I thought these little ring ones were a really nice upgrade addition to the pack system drawers. Here is another duvet cover I came across. I loved the blue and white floral design. It definitely reminded me all of all the Delftware dishes and I love those designs. I saw lots of pretty placemats. I loved the diagonal black and white striped one. And then I also really loved this beautiful floral one. I had also never seen these wood Lazy Susan Turners. These were $15 and would be great for some DIY projects. I also came across this watercolor koi fish shower curtain that I thought was beautiful and I kind of regret not buying it. And then on to the pillow section. This throw pillow section is probably one of my favorite parts in Ikea. I love looking at all the new different textiles that come out. This is pretty much where I get all of my covers from and they're all always really fairly priced. I found myself really drawn to this neutral textured one but it kind of had that checker print harlequin pattern on it i also spotted this camel pillow cover from across the room and I thought it was so cute. It definitely doesn't go with anything in my house, but I really loved the design and it had some really cute stitching details. I needed to grab a few more hangers for my closet, so I grabbed another set and I also came across these hangers, which I think are new. So they're the same style as the wood ones that I use in my closet, but they have this velvet coating on part of it for like the no slip. And these little octopus clippies are great for hang drying your bras. I randomly came across this tiny little Ikea bag keychain. It was by itself, but it was so cute. I've seen a lot of people do some DIY Ikea hacks with these shoe storage holders. I think these are really good pieces for people who are limited on space and you get two of them for 30 bucks. I use a lot of these Tijena, I don't, I'm not, I don't even know how to say it. These cardboard based storage boxes, I use a lot of them in my home office. And this blue color with the leopard print on the inside, I think is new because I'd never seen it before. I thought it was so pretty. And I found this desk mat that I decided to bring home with me. I also love all of the plants at Ikea, both the real 
house plants and the faux house plants. They have a really good selection for the most part. The prices are fair and I feel like most of the faux plants are pretty good realistic looking quality. These big fiddle leaf figs as well as the faux majesty palms were $50 each. And now I just wanted to show you guys my little Ikea haul. I didn't get that much, but I feel like these are all really good pieces. So I got some more throw pillows. I always get all my throw pillows from Ikea and then just buy covers. So I needed a couple more for the couch outside on my screened in porch. And then I got another set of hangers. So I just get the black ones, but I think they come in white and wood as well. And then I got two more of these drawer organizers, which fit perfectly in the Alex drawers, which is what I use in my desk. So these are always very helpful. Obviously they can fit in other drawers too, but they're just perfect fit for those Alex drawers. And then this is probably my favorite find, which I had never seen before, a new item. And it's this desk mat here that is this like beige neutral leopard print. I thought it was really pretty. It was only $5. My desk is definitely starting to get pretty destroyed from all my projects and crafting. It's looking a little rough. So this will kind of both help me keep it a little bit cleaner as well as hide all the marks and scuffs that I have on there currently. So yeah, super excited about that one. This was also a new find that I had never seen there before. Just a little plastic organizer. I figured this would be good for some sort of crafting supplies. And then I got another set of these scubs. <laughs> Scubs. Um, I already have a few of these, but they're all white. I was a little upset I couldn't find any white ones, but I figured whatever, they're going in a drawer. So I grabbed the gray ones. And these organizers fit perfectly in the Malm dressers, which is actually what Sam and I have on each side of our bed here. So that is my little Ikea haul. And make sure you hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. Thank you guys so much for coming along with me to Ikea. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.